Temperatures this cold could also put your home at risk. Freezing water can cause your pipes to burst and force you to pick up the phone and call a plumber. That's right, ABC 2 News Cheryl Connor live in Rogers Forge tonight with some tips on how to keep that water running smoothly. Cheryl? Yeah, Kelly and Jamie, I say we're getting personal with the water pipes. And here's what the experts say you should do. You should shut it off from the inside and then open it up out here and let all that water drain out. Plumbers are on standby knowing these cold temperatures will cause some water pipes to burst. They barely get a break inside the call center for Roto-Rooter. Do we have an order to come out for a toilet bowl that is clogged? Their business is keeping your pipes from bursting. As the cold weather turns to record setting and dangerous, the phones don't stop ringing. The hub in Linthicum covers calls coming in from Buffalo to Fort Lauderdale. 4,300 cold weather problems came in on Saturday alone. That's about double their typical volume. A lot of backups, um, outside backups, main sewer line backups to the house. Uh, we do. We have had a couple frozen pipes that have busted a couple hose bibs. It will only get busier here tomorrow, so we started asking today how you can avoid a massive headache in your own house. That cold air gets trapped in that cabinet, and, then, and unless you open those up and let the, the, the warm air to get in there, that's where you get a lot of your frozen pipes. Also allow a small amount of water to flow from the spigots overnight, and it's time to head outside before the cold air pushes in. For your outside spigots, you definitely want to turn off those uh, ahead of time before you get the freezing and then open up the valves on the outside to drain the water out so you don't get that freezing coming into the pipe. Yeah, and the experts say it doesn't matter what that pipe is made of. It has the potential to burst when the temperatures are in the single digits. We joined you guys at 5, 5.30 and 6. It has gotten so much colder within that time. So head outside, prepare your home, and then come back inside and bundle up. Back to you. All right, temperatures are expected to dip so low that we might see school closings or delays tomorrow. So stay informed with the ABC 2 News weather app. You can get closings and delays right to your smartphone. And if you don't have it, get it at abc2news.com slash download.